Hello students, welcome back to Ishwari Taniksha channel. This is Ishwari ma'am and today in this video we are going to see a trick to calculate nearest neighbor distance and coordination number in simple cube. Okay, so here you can see there are three types of atoms. One is nearest atom, next nearest atom and next to next nearest atom. So first let us draw a simple cube. So draw a simple cube. So this is a simple cube. So consider one atom in the corner. So this is the atom which is present in the corner. You know that corner atom's contribution will be 1 by 8. So now uh, this corner atom is in touch with this atom which is in the edge. So this is one and here this is second one and from here to here third one. Okay, first, second and third. So the contribution of this atoms will be 1 by 4. 1 by 4. So this will be 1 by 4 and even this atom will be 1 by 4. So next will be this atom which is passing through the face diagonal. So here this atom and then from here to this atom and from here there is another face diagonal here. So the contribution of this atoms will be 1 by 2. 1 by 2, 1 by 2 and 1 by 2. And next the atom which is, pa uh, which is connected to this atom through the body diagonal. So here this is the body diagonal which is passing through the body diagonal. And here the uh, contribution of this atom will be 1. So this you should remember. Okay. Which is passing through the edge. Edge. The contribution of that atom will be 1 by 4. If it is passing through the face diagonal. Contribution will be 1 by 2. And if it is passing through the body diagonal. Contribution will be 1. So this you need to remember. So now let us find which is the atom nearest to this corner atom. So let me draw another uh, simple cube here. So this is the simple cube. Okay and this is one corner atom. Consider one corner atom. So now this edge length. Okay from here to here. If an atom is present. So this distance we call it as A. Okay, edge length and it is represented by A. And here, from here to here. Okay, from here to here, the distance is root 2A. So, it is called as face diagonal. And from here to here, from this atom to this atom. So, here this is the body diagonal and its distance is root 3A. So, this we have discussed in the first video. You can go through it. So, from here to here the distance is called as edge length and it is represented by A. From here to here this is face diagonal. Its uh, value is root 2A. From here to here body diagonal and its value is root 3A. So, which is uh, out of this three atom, which atom is close to this atom? So, A is the smallest value. So, this atom will be the nearest atom to this. The next smallest value will be root 2a. So, this atom will be close to this atom. So, this atom is called next nearest atom. And third will be next to next nearest atom. This one. Okay. So, here you can write the distance. Okay. Nearest atom distance is a. Next nearest. So, this is the next nearest atom. What is its distance? Root 2a. Next is next to next nearest so this atom will be next to next nearest atom what is its distance root 3 a so here you will write root 3 a so this is the distance of nearest next nearest and next to next nearest so now let us find the coordination number of this atoms okay so let's let us first find the coordination number of nearest atom so draw a simple cube here Okay, simple cube and this is the corner atom. So, here coordination number of nearest atom. So, which is the nearest atom here? Nearest atom is which is present on the edge. So, see here this is the atom which is present on the edge. So, here from here to here this is the edge atom which will be close to this. 
so next will be from here to here this atom and next is from here to here third one okay what is its contribution see here its contribution is 1 by 4 from here to here this atom contribution is 1 by 4 this atom contribution is 1 by 4 so 1 by 4 1 by 4 and 1 by 4 so now let us calculate the coordination number how many corner atoms are there in this uh, simple cubic unit cell 8 okay 8 are there and it is in touch with how many atoms 1 2 3 3 what is its contribution 1 by 4 4 ones are 4 twos are 2 threes are 6 so 6 will be the coordination number of nearest atom okay next let us see the coordination number of next nearest atom so draw a simple cube again so let me draw a simple cube okay consider a corner atom again here so this is the corner atom so now next nearest will be root 2a which is present on the face diagonal so from here to here this is the next nearest atom and then from here to here this is the next nearest atom and from here to here next nearest atom so see here next nearest atom what is its contribution 1 by 2 so here you will write 1 by 2 1 by 2 and then 1 by 2 so now let us calculate so how many corner atoms are there 8 into it is in touch with how many atoms now 1 2 3 okay what is its contribution 1 by 2 2 ones are 2 4s are 8 4 threes are 12 so 12 will be the coordination number of next nearest atom so now let us see what is the coordination number of next to next nearest atom so draw a simple cube so this is a simple cube again okay consider a corner atom so now uh, so now this is in touch uh, next or uh, nearest to nearest atom distance is root 3a so root 3a is passing through the diagonal uh, body diagonal so here it will be in touch with this atom so what is the contribution of this atom see here what is the contribution of that atom 1 so 1 will be the contribution of this atom so now if we calculate how many corner atoms are there 8 it is in touch with how many atom 1 what is its contribution 1 so this is equal to 8 so 8 will be the coordination number of next to next nearest atom okay so this is about the distance and the coordination number of nearest atom next nearest atom and next to next nearest atom so this type of questions they will be asking in neat examination so uh, go through this and uh, be thorough with this type of calculations so students i'll meet you in the next video bye bye